welcome you all once again in our online lecture series of artificial intelligence now today uh, this is our lecture number 16 and topic that we are going to discuss today is the alpha beta pruning in artificial intelligence okay last time we have studied uh, the min max algorithm and the things related with that we have discussed like that kind of algorithm being utilized in case of the game theory means when there is a uh, game is being played between the two players then how the artificial intelligence can be utilized in that case and that is being uh, done with the help of the min max algorithm that we have discussed last time also we have discussed the example where that kind of algorithm being utilized in the two player games like the tic tac toe chess go game this kind of things we have discussed and uh, there we have uh, experienced some major drawback of the min max algorithm and uh, today we are going to uh, we are trying to provide the solution for that uh, drawbacks with the help of another variant of min max algorithm that is being called as the alpha beta pruning first you tell me what are the drawbacks of the min max algorithm and then we proceed further yes what are the drawbacks of the min max algorithm we need to check every node means each, the, and every. each and every node has to be checked yes. and yes. Uh, because of that what happened the time memory requirement required. memory requirement will be very much high uh, for some games it may be there may be no problem like if you see the tic tac toe game because it is having the less number of movements and the less number of choices but if you try to apply that kind of game for the chase then there will be the uh, huge uh, what can say the time complexity and the space complexity because for the chase game the number of movements and the choices are very much high as compared with the uh, what you can say the tic tac toe game okay that point all of you understood now how we can uh, manage these things so that we have to check minimum number of nodes and make the decision so mainly the main aim of the min max algorithm is nothing but the how it will help to the ai player to make the decision means to make the decision in the sense which move which move that player should make understood correct that point we have discussed now what we want how we can minimize the number of uh what we can say number of comparison that is need to be done to decide the which move the ai player will make and to provide the solution here we have the another variant of min max algorithm and that is called as the alpha beta pruning okay so it is being also considered as one of the optimization technique for the min max algorithm optimization technique for the min max in the sense it is it is trying to uh, what we can say remove or uh, it is trying to reduce the kind of uh, kind of checking that we have to do in case of the min max algorithm that's why it is being considered as a uh, optimization technique for the min max algorithm okay as in case of the min max algorithm uh, search uh, algorithm that we have studied the number of states the number of game state it has to be examined are exponential in the depth of the tree means whatever the depth of the tree uh, accordingly the number of uh, what we can say the searches has to be performed and uh, so what we are going to try using this algorithm we are 
trying to uh, reduce this kind of what we can say reduce this kind of comparison or reduce this kind of checking that we need to perform in the minimax min algorithm okay so uh, this is the technique by which without checking each node of the game tree will compute the correct min max decision what is the this is nothing but the main feature of this technique what using this technique what we are going to do without checking each node of the game tree we will compute the correct min max decision in the example that we will see how it is happening and uh, what and that is why this particular technique is called as the pruning pruning in the sense cutting some part okay what is the meaning of pruning cutting some part now here why, what we are going to cut we are going to cut some part of that particular game tree understood meaning of the cutting the part of the game tree in the sense we are not going to check each and every node is that under all of you understood this point yes sir all of you understood yes. meaning of the pruning means well, we are going to cut some part of the some part of the that game tree okay cutting the some part of the that game tree yes. in the sense we are not going to visit or we are not going to check each and every node of that particular game tree and that is the reason this algorithm is called as what the pruning what pruning now what exactly this alpha beta represent that we will see okay now in this algorithm we are going to utilize two uh, two threshold parameters okay one of that parameter is called the alpha and another parameter is called the beta beta okay we will see what exactly that represent okay and that is the reason this algorithm is called as the alpha beta algorithm or alpha beta pruning algorithm in the artificial intelligence okay i hope all of you understood why it is called the alpha beta pruning we are going to utilize the two parameters here alpha and beta and pruning in the sense we have to cut down the tree uh, uh, into the so uh, so that uh, we can reduce the number of checking that we have to perform okay so alpha beta pruning we are going to apply at the particular depth of the tree okay and when we are applying these alpha beta pruning uh, sometimes we 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 may cut or we we may prune some leaves of the tree means we may uh, cut some one node two node okay or sometimes it may happen we can cut entire sub tree also okay this is a very important characteristic what when you are applying the alpha beta pruning to the some game tree sometimes according to the condition we may we may allow to cut only the some nodes that is some nodes in the say some leaves only and sometimes if the condition satisfy what exactly that condition that we will see if the condition satisfy we may cut down entire sub tree also understood now let's see further features related with this and the parameters so as i said there are the utilization of the two parameters that is the alpha and the beta now what exactly alpha represent this you must understand very well because this we are going to need in the example so what alpha represent the alpha represent the the best choice we have found so far which player maximizer means alpha represent the value of which player maximizer, maximizer player maximizer understood and the initial value for the alpha is what the worst value of the maximizer that is the minus infinity minus infinity correct yes then come to the next parameter that is what beta now beta is representing what the best value found so far for which player minimizer minimizer so beta is representing value of who, whom value of what the minimizing player minimizer okay. player similar the initial value for the beta is going to the worst value of the minimizer that is what plus infinity okay now let's see how this uh, proceeds here i have written the alpha beta pruning as a standard min max algorithm or uh, another variant of the min max algorithm uh, it will return the same move that we are that we have seen in case of the min max algorithm but it removes the some particular particular kind of nodes okay it will remove all the nodes which not going to affect on the final decision okay 
and if you remove some nodes which will not affect the final decision remove in the sense we are going to prun we are going to perform the action of pruning understood now if you remove some node or meaning of that if you remove some node is what if you don't check all the nodes of that game tree definitely the algorithm will be going to be the faster or not instead of checking all the nodes of the game tree if some limited nodes are get checked algorithm will be faster yes sir but if you check all the nodes that is going to make the algorithm slow understood mm, yes and that is the reason alpha beta pruning is better than the min max how it is better that we will see the better feature uh, the uh, alpha beta pruning is better than the min max the feature for that is nothing but what in alpha beta pruning we are going to cut down or we are going to remove some nodes while we are while we are uh, searching for the or while we are trying to make the decision for the particular ai player understood so pruning the nodes or cutting down the nodes of this game tree that is being also called as the pruning the nodes make this algorithm faster understood this point what this algorithm may make faster pruning the nodes correct pruning in the sense we are not going to visit or we are going we are not going to check each and every node understood so yes, meaning of we are not going to check each and every node means we are pruning some nodes we are going to remove okay. some nodes and if you remove some nodes then definitely this algorithm will become more faster as compared with the mean max algorithm algorithm correct up to this understood yes sir sir okay yes, sir. now what that condition that condition i am talking about what is that condition which is required for the alpha beta pruning and that condition required for the alpha beta pruning is nothing but this okay when you can perform the pruning action understood keep in this mind what when you can perform the pruning action when value of alpha is greater than or equal to beta what when you can perform the pruning when al when value of alpha is greater than or equal to beta okay keep in mind these things we are going to apply this to the uh, our, our example understood let's take uh, see some another points related with the alpha beta pruning and then we will go to the example the max player will always update the value of what alpha as we are representing the max player by the alpha correct okay what the max player will do max player will always update the value of what alpha alpha and the main player main player will only update the value of beta 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 correct then another two important points here you have to keep in mind as as we have seen in the min max uh, we need to perform the back tracking correct here also we are need to perform the back tracking okay and while doing the back tracking the nodes node of that particular tree will only pass the value to the upper nodes means to the its parent correct keep this keep this keep this point in your mind because this we are going to apply in the example what the particular node value will be passed to the only upper nodes means to the parent nodes this node value will not will not change the value of alpha and beta okay that will see in the example what exactly this but you just keep in mind this the node value will pass only to the upper nodes instead of values of alpha and beta alpha value of alpha and beta we are not going to pass to the upper words to the upper nodes okay while doing the back tracking this is the one point another point we will pass the alpha beta values to the child nodes only okay these two points are very important on these two points only our, uh, our alpha beta pruning is based what is the first point the node values will be passed to to the which nodes upper nodes correct and second point is what alpha beta values will be passed to the which nodes 
child child, child notes okay keep these two points in uh, you know mind first is what the child the nodes will node value will be passed to the upper nodes and the alpha beta values will only pass to the child child notes okay let's see how this uh, happen now this is our example okay and uh, okay all of you can able to see the screen yes sir okay yes. now uh, let's take here we have taken the example of two player uh, search tree uh, in order to understand the working of the alpha beta running okay uh, let's see the step 1 now initially now this is the game tree okay this is the game tree this is the max player main player max player and these are the terminal nodes which you are given with, uh, with the terminal values okay so at the first step you can read here at the first step the max player will start from the node a correct as we see in the previous example also we will start from the initial node and then we reach to the bottom of the tree correct <laughs> like in the way of the dfs so in the similar way here the max player will start move from the node a this is your node a where now here initially you can see the value of alpha and beta each particular node will have the alpha and beta value okay here for the node a value of alpha and beta is what alpha is equal to how much Minus infinity, minus, minus infinity as its uh, worst value, and beta is how much? Plus infinity. Plus infinity. Or the simple infinity also It doesn't matter. So these are the initial value. Now this value will pass to the bottom, as I have mentioned here. We'll start move from the node A. Max player will start move from the node A with where the value are alpha equal to minus infinity and beta equal to plus infinity. These values of alpha and beta. will pass down to the node b means first when coming down side first it will come here then from these again the value of alpha and beta will also remain same because we have still not updated the values and node b passes the same value to the last node that is the what our node child d this is our last node correct now when it is reaches to this node then the updation of value will start okay that is our next step okay now at the node d at the node d we are going to calculate the alpha okay now at the node d which player is playing at this node max max is playing okay at the node d max is playing okay now here we have to calculate there for the value of alpha the value of alpha is compare with the its terminal values now what are the value of what are the terminal values of d 2 and 2 and 3 3 and 3 so now alpha values three. initially value of alpha is how much minus infinity minus infinity so minus infinity will compare with the 2 which one is the max 2 2 so here we write the 2 then again the minus infinity will be compare with the 3 which will be the max 3 3 so here we have got the max that is the 2 comma 3 out of these two which one is the maximum 3 and that's why here we have written the value of alpha will be 3 okay value of alpha will be 3 at which node d node that's why you can see here alpha is equal to 3 3 understood can here mm. beta value will get change no 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 beta value cannot get change at this node now from this point what will what will happen from this point we will do the back tracking correct back tracking yes now in the step 3 you can yes. read here the algorithm back track to the node b this node where the value of beta will be change now beta because change. beta representing the minimizing player understood as the alpha representing the which player 
maximizer flame okay maximum value so here the beta value will be changed as this is the turn off which player minimizer player. minimum now initially value of beta is how much plus infinity plus infinity plus infinity correct now now beta will be compare with what its subsequent nodes means child node of the b correct now hmm. which are the child of b d and d. e Yeah. Now we don't know about the E. We know about the D. Correct? Yes. So we'll compare infinity with the what is the value of node D three? Correct. So we'll compare the infinity with the three. So at the node B, what will be the value of beta? Three. The value of beta will be three. Three. Understood. So here value of beta will be get updated as what? Three. Understood. But the value of alpha is still remain how much? Minus infinity. Correct. Hmm. Because what yes, I said sir. that two points I told you, the node only update the value of its upper nodes. The D will update the value of its upper node that is the B. the alpha beta values will not be passed to the upper nodes understood and that's why here value of alpha was 3 this will not pass to the upper words to the upper node correct this this point okay. understood yes sir. initial value of a alpha ah, so mm -hmm. at the javes apan a pasun khali alelo when we are tra when we are traversing to the depth we have mm -hmm. updated the value of beta was uh, value, value of at this point of alpha was how much minus infinity that will remain minus okay. infinity itself understood okay. and when we are when we are back tracking from the d the value of beta will be get changed because at this point which player is playing minimizer player so minimizer player will try to select the minimum so here only we have the value of d is 3 and that's why here minimizer will compare plus infinity and the 3 which is the minimum 3 is the minimum understood mm -hmm. and that's why here mm -hmm. you get the value of beta is how much 3 3 understood yes sir okay now in the next step now it is up to this point it is clear in the next step algorithm traverses to the next successor of node b which is the next successor of the node b e e, e. this is the next successor of the node b understood now at the node e again we have to apply the same procedure okay now when when we are coming to the node b uh, sorry to the node e when we are coming to the node e which value comes along with that do you understand the question when we are coming to the node e which value come along with that max um, alpha max alpha and beta alpha and beta both will come as mm. as you can see in, in that statement i told you you have to keep mm. like these two mm. points okay let me show it once again these two points i have told you the node values will be passed to the upper nodes mm. and alpha beta values will be passed to the child nodes only these two points correct yes, and that's mm. why you can see here at this point when we are coming to the successor of b that is the successor of b is the e the alpha beta value is come along with that now what was the value of alpha minus infinity and beta 3 barobar itle value khali etil up to means for the node e now let's see in the next step what happen now in the next step at the node e which value will be get change max value of alpha or the value of beta alpha alpha will get change because here which player alpha. is playing maximizer max player maximizer. now what will happen max. at the node node what will happen at the node e tell me so firstly comparison the initial value hoti alpha chi minus infinity te compare karel tacha child node sobat five and minus infinity hoti ti minus infinity kashavar compare hoil 
फाईव्ह बरोबर अगोदर फाईव्ह बरोबर होईल ना सो आउट ऑफ द मायनस इन्फिनिटी अँड द फाईव्ह विच वन इज द ग्रेटर मॅक्सिमम फाईव्ह इज द मॅक्सिमम करेक्ट फाईव्ह इज द मॅक्सिमम अँड दॅट्स वाय द व्हॅल्यू ऑफ अल्फा ऍट द ई विल बिकम फाईव्ह करेक्ट बट यू कॅन सी ई इज ऑल्सो हॅव्हिंग द अनदर चाय अनदर नोड इज देअर फॉर द ई दिस नोड whose value is how much 9 9 now can the alpha can the alpha value will get change my question can the alpha value will get change now just like here you have compare okay keep in mind one condition here just like here you have compare what you have compare minus infinity and 5 correct five. Five. Mm. here you have get the result 5 understood and mm. here at this point what we will compare minus infinity and 9 9 what is the result 9 now what you have to compare 5 and 9 5 and 9 what five is the maximum nine. value 9 yes 9 is the maximum value 9 correct but keep in mind here when you have got the value of alpha here 5 at that time value of beta was how much 3 3 understood so here here we will apply the condition which condition which condition i told you zua switch off your mic alpha is greater than equal to beta greater than equal to beta now is it satisfying here yes sir yes now when it is satisfying what we have to do pruning when alpha is greater than equal to beta what you have to do pruning pruning in the sense what what i told pruning means what what do we have to cut down no you have to cut down some node now which node here we have to cut down this node we have to cut down here you got the point hmm yes understood and that is the reason alpha value remain how much 5 5 now consider now consider we'll take the value of alpha here 9 what 9 9 still our condition is satisfying you are getting what i'm saying yes sir but point here is what point here is what which player is going to select the value now b is the parent node of the d and e correct mm. now b is the which b name of this player is what minimizer 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 he will select the minimum value from this node and the this node yes sir ani manun ita tumhi alpha chi value 5 thevli kiwa 9 9 thevli tar select value kutli honar hai 3 3 is honar hai na and that is the reason that condition is very important that condition gives you the idea about these things in advance you got the point you got the point that condition gives you the idea of these things in advance and that is the reason here there is a no need to check this node got the point yes or no yes you are getting what i am saying because here alpha is greater than equal to beta and when the alpha is greater than equal to beta no need to perform the checking of next successor and that is the reason pruning will happen here correct okay you you got the point yes sir and if instead of applying the alpha beta pruning here consider we are applying here the min max algorithm आपल्याला हे चेक करावं लागलं असतं की नाही करावं लागलं असतं ना दॅट इज द बेनिफिट ऑफ वॉट अल्फा ब्रिटा प्रनिंग 
आता इथं आपण तुम्ही म्हणत असाल की आपण तर चेक केलं सर इथं तर चेक हे तुम्हाला सांगण्यासाठी मी केलं इथं फक्त की डिफरन्स काय यु गॉट द पॉइंट यू डोंट हॅव टू चेक एनिथिंग वन्स यू गॉट द कंडिशन वॉट अल्फा इज ग्रेटर दॅन इक्वल टू बीटा ओके ऍट द मुमेंट यू गेट दिस कंडिशन सॅटिस्फाईड व्हॉट एव्हर द फर्दर नोड्स ऑफ दिस पर्टिक्युलर नोड इ दॅट विल बी नॉट गेट चेक वॉट द पॉइंट Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. And that is the reason here this node will not be, will be checked. This node will get prun. Okay. This another child of E will get prun. And so prun. here you can see uh, the current value of alpha will be compared with the five. So we'll get the five and hence at the node E alpha equal to five and beta equal to three. And that three. is satisfying this condition alpha is greater than equal to beta. So the right successor of E will get prun. That is, this is the right successor mm. of E. and algorithm will not traverse it and the value of node e will be now how much now what will be the value of node five. e 5 five. 5 five. correct what is the value of node yes, e now 5 five. Five. now let's see five. proceed further what will happen so in the next step uh, we can see again we backtrack correct we backtrack ata apan ito to itun ata aplyala kay we need to go backtrack understood we will come to at this point understood so at the from this node again from b again we need to backtrack yes so we will go to the at the node a the value of alpha will change now at this point in the first tree i have shown you value of alpha was how much minus, minus infinity minus minus and beta was how much आता ज्यावेळेस आपण बॅकट्रॅक करू त्यावेळेस आपल्याला अल्फाची व्हॅल्यू किती होती आपली थ्री कशी होती फायू पण नसणार फायू पण नसणार फायू कशी असेल नाही सर इन्फिनिटी होती मायनस इन्फिनिटी इन्फिनिटी मायनस इन्फिनिटी इथं बघा ना ही व्हॅल्यू मायनस इन्फिनिटी होती ना हा हा ही जी व्हॅल्यू ऑफ फायव ही दिस व्हॅल्यू ऑफ फायव विल नॉट गेट अपडेटेड विथ अल्फा अल्फा और बीटा अंडरस्टूड दिस व्हॅल्यू कॅन ओनली अपडेट द इट्स पॅरेट नोड ओनली इफ आता इथं तुम्ही जर म्हणत असा बी ची व्हॅल्यू चेंज होईल का सांगा मला बी ची व्हॅल्यू अगोदर किती होती थ्री होती आता इथं प्लेअर कुठला प्ले करणार आहे मिनिमायझर मिनिमायझर फाईव्ह सिलेक्ट करेल का इन्स्टेड ऑफ थ्री नाही बीची व्हॅल्यू तीच राहील अंडरस्टूड अँड सो हिअर ऍट दिस पॉइंट वी हॅव अल्फा इक्वल टू मायनस इन्फिनिटी अँड बीटा इज इक्वल टू थ्री लेट्स इन दॉइंट दॅट वी आर डिस्कसिंग हिअर ऍट द नोड ए नाव व्हेन यू आर बॅक ट्रॅकिंग फ्रॉम दिस पॉइंट व्हेन यू आर बॅक ट्रॅकिंग फ्रॉम दिस पॉइंट वी आर हॅव्हिंग द व्हॅल्यू ऑफ alpha and beta was how much alpha was the minus infinity minus infinity and uh, beta was 3 plus infinity beta was 3 hmm. and the value of this node was 3 now at this point which player is playing maximizer maximizer now maximizer will select which value alpha will it will compare the minus infinity minus with the 3 मॅक्सिमम सिलेक्ट करायचा ना त्याला बरोबर थ्री तो काय सिलेक्ट करेल थ्री करेक्ट अँड दॅट्स वाय हिअर द अल्फा व्हॅल्यू गेट अपडेटेड थ्री दॅट इज बिकम हाऊ मच थ्री अल्फा इक्वल टू थ्री अँड बीटा इक्वल टू इन्फिनिटी अंडरस्टूड सो यू कॅन सी हिअर ऍट द नोड ए द व्हॅल्यू ऑफ अल्फा will be changed the maximum value which is 3 uh, because uh, out of the minus infinity and 3 the maximum is 3 and beta will remain plus infinity only so these two values are now passes to the right successor of node a now who is the right successor of node a c the right successor of node a is which node c c right successor of node a is what c c c understood 
so alpha beta value will be passed to the uh, to the next node c node correct c node yes sir as we have discussed alpha beta values will pass to the child nodes mm -hmm. understood so at the node c alpha is how much 3 and beta is how much plus, plus infinity. infinity so again same value plus will infinity. be passed to the node f आपल्याला डेफ ला जायचंय ना बॉटम ला जायचंय ना करेक्ट तर सी चा नेक्स्ट नोड एफ अंडरस्टूड सो नाव व्हॉट विल हॅपन ऍट दिस पॉइंट अल्फा व्हॅल्यू व्हॅल्यू ऑफ वी हॅव कम विथ व्हॅल्यू ऑफ अल्फा इक्वल टू थ्री अँड बीटा इक्वल टू इन्फिनिटी correct so at this node we have to perform we have to perform the comparison of its terminal node values yes sir understood now when you are coming down we have the alpha equal to 3 3 you will compare the 3 with 0 mm -hmm. that is here you can see here max 3 comma 0 3 3 and also you will compare with the right child which is 1 1 so we will compare so uh, you we will compare the 3 with 1 which is the maximum 3 3 does the alpha value will change here no it will remain 3 only because maximum is itha jar ekadi value maximum asti tar alpha chi value change jala asti barobar hmm pan itha maximum nahi hai na hmm so alpha value will remain same same understood but what will be the value of node f नोड एफ ची वैल्यू का वैल्यू जी मैक्सिम वैल्यू जी वैल्यू वन वन गॉट द पॉइंट इत अपन रनिंग परफॉर्म करू शो का इत अल्फा इज नॉट ग्रेटर दैन इक्वल टू बीटा सो हियर यू कैन नॉट परफॉर्म द रनिंग सो वॉट यू कैन डू हियर यू नीड टू डू द बैक ट्रैकिंग बैक ट्रैकिंग ओके सो इन द नेक्स्ट स्टेप वील डू द बैक ट्रैकिंग so we will backtrack back like this now when you are backtracking when you are backtracking which value you can carry one one mm. correct you can carry only the one, one. as i said yeah. node value only updated its upper nodes now when you are when you carry this value to the its uh, parent node c now at the c alpha and beta value will get change alpha chi value tar tis rahil because here which player is playing minimizer minimizer minimum minimizer minimizer has to do what he has to select the minimum value of its whatever the child minimum is evaluated ata apan kutla child c cha evaluate kela only the f we have evaluated hmm. correct so tachi value kiti hoti 1 manun beta chi value kay vali ta 1 so here one. One. at the node c we have the alpha equal to 3 and bit previously beta was plus infinity here the value of beta will be get change it will compare with the one so plus infinity compare with the one, one. which one is the minimum one so that's why here the beta value become one now at the node c alpha one. is equal to 3 and beta is equal to 1 correct ata node c var baka what we have got alpha equal to 3 and beta alpha equal to 3 and beta equal to 1 1 now can the pruning perform here yes sir yes sir alpha is greater yes, than beta you can beta. perform the pruning and that is the reason yes sir you will prun this complete easily see here yahan pe aap dekh sakte ho ki yahan par kya ho raha hai yahan par condition jo hai hamari kaun si condition alpha is greater than equal to beta beta that condition is satisfying here yes does we need to go backward yes. does we need to go in this below direction now no no sir if you cut down these are agar agar if you cut down this branch zada chi fandi jar tumhi to todli tar he saglas kay honar hai कटना एवरीथिंग विल बी कट डाउन कट डाउन दैट इज कॉल्ड एज व्हाट कांसेप्ट ऑफ रनिंग 
जर आप इफ यू आर ट्राइंग टू अप्लाई मीन मैक्स अपने सग चेक कर रीजन हियर वी नॉट वी नीड नॉट टू डू ऑल दीज थिंग्स एंड फ्रॉम धीज पॉइंट ओनली वील अगेन बैक ट्रैक इत संपल नहीं आप करेक्ट सो फ्रॉम धीज पॉइंट वी नीड टू बैक ट्रैक करेक्ट ना वेन यू आर बैक ट्रैकिंग वॉट यू आर कैरिंग विथ युअर सेल्फ वन वन सो वेर वेन यू रीच टू धीस पॉइंट हियर यू हेव द प्रीवियस आल्फा वैल्यू दैट वॉज हाउ मच थ्री ना वेन यू रीच टू धीस पॉइंट विच प्लेयर इज गोइंग टू प्ले maximizer now what value the maximizer will select maximum value ata ikde from this, he is getting 3 from here he is getting 1 so out of 3 and 1 which is the maximum 3 3 is the maximum yes and so this particular at this point the alpha beta pruning will suggest to the ai agent or to the ai player that he should prefer this path this path instead of this path this path to win the game again you got the point you got the point yes sir so this is nothing but our final game tree which is showing the nodes which are computed and the nodes which are never computed you can see this cross sign indicate these nodes are never being computed understood and here the optimal value for the maximizer is which 3 understood yes sir and the point that i told you in case of the alpha beta pruning sometime sometime only only the single leaves will get cut like this correct sometimes entire sub tree can be get cut this is the sub tree this is the sub tree yes sir and that is nothing but the concept of what alpha beta alpha beta running now which is the more beneficial beneficial mean max alpha or the alpha beta running alpha beta running beta running the alpha beta running understood Yes, sir. Yes. Now, yes, sir. in order to keep track of which nodes are prun, okay, there can be the utilization of close list also. Okay, open list and close list. That point in the last time we have discussed. Okay, we are not shown shown it here because uh, we can understand from this uh, uh, algorithm only. Okay, the steps we have taken only. Okay. okay so that's it from the unit first uh, we have cover all the particular important part from the unit first and from the next lecture we'll start with the second unit okay so your homework already i told you you have to go through the whatever videos we have uh, whatever things we have discussed till and for that you can refer to the video that i have uploaded on the youtube okay any difficulty you can always ask me i hope today's session was interesting and all of you got the point correct yes sir yes sir okay thank you all of you thank you sir thank you sir yes sir